Baby bottle pop. Baby bottle pop. Dude, when's the last time you had a baby bottle pop? I think eighth grade. Eighth grade? That long ago? I easily had one in my 20s, I think. Good for you, dude. It's been some time. Still waiting on that email from John Doe. If you're not familiar, I, I should be expecting an email from John Doe because we emailed him about that body outline under the freaking floorboards that we found. Did we just discover a murder scene? Oh, boy. <laughs> some time has gone by and uh, something else has happened. It continues to happen. I haven't told you this yet, Sam. There's, That's why I told you to get the camera. There's more? <laughs> I got another alert. Have you looked at it Isn't this yet? getting old? See what I mean? It is. Did you look at it? What? Everyone keeps asking me that. It's a genuine question. Did you look at it? I don't have access. Well, that makes two of us. Because Ness works so slow, it's like I don't have access. Yeah. Where was the alert? Was it Red Same Base place. again? Same place. Upstairs Red Base. Oh, where the floorboards were? Okay, I don't know that any one of us has been up there yet. No, why would we go up there? It's a gravestone. Know. Graveyard. It's a graveyard of GG. What the frick is up? What? Okay, I was gonna say, you, oh, think, you think there's a body buried there? Yeah, is this the part where Do we- Do you wanna go? Get everyone and go look at it? Yeah. It looks like everyone's just right here anyways. They saw you get out the camera and they're like, something's <laughs> happening. Like, Thanks, guys. Yes. Oh, no. So I can see her better. <laughs> <laughs> There's more where that came from. Did you get another alert? I got another alert. Yeah, where? this morning, last night. Well, this morning, technically. I'm where assuming you it? haven't checked it. <laughs> okay, Matt's explained <laughs> this like three times. Where was it? Upstairs red, where GG was. In the, the body same outline. room? Yeah, yeah body outline. we ripped up the floorboards. What if it was actually motion this time? They've always been motion. Well, I mean like with a person. I'm gonna look at the nest alert. We could just walk over there this and look. This is gonna take us like 20 minutes. <laughs> and yeah, so all of a sudden okay. now you don't wanna like, look, no, huh? Oh, that Should happened really, no, nope. gotta try again. Yeah, did it again. Oh, all right, let's just go on. use our eyes. Oh, look, I found it, I loaded it, it loaded. Nothing. Crazy. Legit nothing. There's nothing there at all? There's nothing. But there's, there's no camera in the actual room. Correct, this is the camera that I got a notification yeah. on. Okay, so yeah, let's just go look. Okay. All right. You remember this thing? Did I move? Oh. <laughs> you know what's funny? I had one of these at home once. I taped a cardboard horse head and then like a wig on the back. And I was like, Luna, it's a horse. <laughs> I made her a horse and then she got on with me and I went like this. <laughs> she absolutely loved it. Let's go ride the horse. You think I can take a curb head on? Oh, it's this way. Wait, no, it's this way. Yeah, <gasps> we can go this way. <laughs> Sam's face. <laughs> I feel like something changes in here every time I go. It does look different. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh. That was the same face that was downstairs. That's the smiley face that was on the look closer. Wait, so what does that mean? Do we have to look closer here? I think the best bet is that this means whoever's writing on the wall is who we're talking to, right. is who was killed. Whatever is writing on the wall. Well, I mean, obviously it was a person that is now dead. It is kind of right. weird, doesn't or it? Or it's something feel... shaped like a person. <laughs> There's nothing been on camera, but all this craziness keeps happening. That smiley face with the X's has shown up before downstairs where it said look closer. So that connects it to this. Either that or it's just more graffiti, but it seems oddly placed right on the face. Well, isn't it weird that this ghost is like creating a brand for itself? It feels like it's like a danger. <laughs> that is kind of true. So, like, yeah. yeah. Is this telling us to look closer here, like at the body. What can look closer possibly mean? We're missing things from evidence we already have. Like the answer is in front of us already. Yeah, and we just need to look closer. Or it can mean something entirely different. It could mean like look closer at this specific thing. Metaphorically or metaphysically? Metaphysically. Mm. What, what does that mean? <laughs> Transcending physical matter. Okay. So, like so, the ghost. The yeah, spiritual like plane. So, okay. But how do we or, look closer to that? Like, it could be physical, it could be metaphysical, it could be past, looking at past evidence. It cool. definitely feels like the ghost is trying to let us know that like this was them though. Yeah, because it it's like the it. same smiley face. But we haven't found who this is yet. So yeah, we, we haven't don't know what identity. Them. Yeah. It is weird, I feel like I've kind of been assuming that this is Wes just because of the graveyard incident. We like, found where Wes died. Yeah, we yeah, know we, where Wes died. We don't really have much evidence to go over. No. 
Right. Yeah. And everything I feel like we've gone over and we've given access to the audience to do up close look for those of you that are premium supporters on 863 plus link in the description. They haven't found anything I think that can be attributed to this more specifically, at least without more information, I would say. Okay. And there's no record of like any sort of police investigation. Well, so not that we, we're aware of. John Doe hasn't gone yeah. back. Not that we're aware of. We're trying that path already. But yeah. the other two paths that we have is possibly to look at like the chemical makeup or to look at, like I said, metaphysical. If we're getting into like the metaphysical, do we need to get those like ghost tools out again? Yeah, maybe something like that. Do we have ghost tools? Mm -hmm. I think what we need is something that will help us find like trace. Traces yeah. of EMS or something? EMF? I think, it's EM maybe I think we need to do more research. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we bought stuff on Doper Note before that was mm -hmm. ghostly, and we actually used it, and, and it produced some decent results here downstairs Red Bay's. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can find some more stuff? Is this trying to detect the ghost that's been here, or if it's here right now? I don't Anything know. around? No idea. Well, you, around. you guys want to go to Megadesk? Get out of here? Yeah. It's cold, dude. Any place to start, guys? I mean, do we like want to? Like eBay? Well, so I guess, or, or what, are we, what are we Etsy. looking for? We're looking Definitely for... Definitely not Etsy. <laughs> not Etsy. Okay. Are you kidding me? What about Amazon? We don't want any homemade ghost products. Yeah, I'm like, products. that's gonna be like a tinfoil What, what yeah. do you mean? Well, Why? it's gonna be like a stick with salt on it, and they're gonna be like, this can read negative energy in a room. Sam, you don't know. Yeah, I'm looking just because <laughs> <Okay>. of that. <laughs> you haven't tested their products. Look, they have stuff here. Look at the little ghost, he's cute. What is he? Look doing? at this, EMF ghost detector. That's dope. 254 it, is, reviews. It's $8, that can't Wait. work. What if we get one of those things, gonna... it's like a radio that you change the channel and you can, it's like. A radio? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not a radio. They use it in ghost hunting and you know, like random voices will come through and it's the ghost uh, trying like to this? communicate with you. There's 239 ghosts that? inside of that. Oh, it's mm -hmm. 23.9. Are you talking mm. about just like an audio pickup? Yeah, I don't know what that's I, th called. I think they just like, don't they just, just like record <clears throat> yeah. and then... No, it's like a radio that you like put on a certain channel and it's like going through all the channels and it'll pick up random words that's supposed to be mm. the ghost trying to communicate. What about this you. thing? What is it? It's like a Nokia. Yeah, it it's looks like a hot tub. EMF remote. tester, electromagnetic EMF. field. Or like EMF. The EMF. Yeah. Ghost hunting equipment. Not only measures EMF, but also measures temperature and static energy. What Why does not? EMF stand for? Electromagnetic frequency. Oh. This looks legit. What? I like this. Doesn't it? Nice. it looks like a safe. Quality ultrasonic motion sensor. Okay, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna grab a couple of these things. I'm gonna check eBay too. eBay is where you'll find the good stuff. Yeah, I feel like eBay is the best bet. The stuff passed down through multiple generations of ghost hunters. <laughs> Paranormal equipment. So we have a magnetic field detector. Why would ghosts be shooting off magnetic fields? We all shoot magnetic fields off of us. Speak for yourself, bro. <laughs> Got him. Got him. Too strong. The <laughs> <laughs> spirit nice. box, paranormal ghost hunting. Come That's what I was. Okay, spirit. the spirit box is what I was talking about. Oh, we should get it. Should we grab a spirit box? Yes. Yeah. I think it's the thing where like the ghosts will try to talk to you through different radio radio frequencies. Oh, okay, we okay. should get that. Okay, I'll, I'll save this. Paranormal ghost hunting equipment, EMF pump. What the heck is an EMF pump? So you can pump up the EMF in the room. <laughs> yeah, bruh. It's literally just a switch. Oh. Just like, pump it up. Maybe it um, captures ghosts. Oh, like sucks them in? Yeah. Oh. We've tried this before. Do we have that still? Do we know where that is? Do we have it and do we know where it is are two very different questions. <laughs> <laughs> True. Look at this. Oh, Spirit box. <laughs> this one looks legit. Oh, whoa. It does look legit. It's got more knobs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, more knobs. What do the buttons, buttons say? Do we know Reverb. how to work any of these things? Like, <laughs> I'll save these. Is our plan to just like use these in that room? What ha like what if it's like I think Yeah, beep 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 beep. There's a ghost here. What does that tell us? I think that'd be a good start. Yeah. Okay. Beep. What about like a camera of sorts? Like, is there any specialty cameras? That's a good idea. That can like capture it. Like a paranormal camera? Do thermal yeah. cameras pick up ghosts? <clears throat> they pick up. I mean, I mean, they it's all cold spots. They, yeah, they, they pick up cold spots and stuff like that. Is it a GoPro? But a ghost. <laughs> Ghost GoPro. Oh my god. Yo, that is vicious. Just I love it. Night vision? It's probably literally just a GoPro. Oh, it's it's like probably a, a GoPro that has a damaged sensor. So it's just like, look, a spirit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just static. What's this? A lot of these just look like cameras. ETI paranormal camera. Mm. That one looks interesting. Whoa. It's got it's for iPhone. Oh, what? That's weird. Look at that. It's got an iPhone attachment. Oh, you put yo, you plug it into the bottom that of your iPhone. Hits. Is that $400? No, yeah. wait, I'm really bad at vision. Oh, what the heck? Oh, 
is posing. That's terrifying. Wait, go, go back to that blue picture. Say less. When I first looked at that, it looked like they had a square box on their head, and I was like, Deb? See? Oh. But it looks maybe. like a person oh. is standing with their hand on their hip like this, and I see like a square outline on you the head. Picture Deb, you... I picture the computer. What's computer happening Deb? here? Yeah. Is that a ghost or just a person? That just looks that's like just a, a person. See, that's what I'm concerned. Is this just a filter for... Do we trust anybody that takes a to selfie like, like a that? Ghost? Well, do we I don't trust know. something like this that's $450? I mean, it looks That's like it's getting results. The description. I said we try it. It's a camera. I, I, do you think those pictures are a reality? I don't know. It's worth trying. Okay. It's expensive, though. <laughs> the iPhone attachment allows for easy access into the paranormal world, granting you the ability to see paranormal activity or any trace plasma of said activity. Using electromagnetic sensors, military-grade thermal imaging technology, LiDAR, and static resistance, we've been able to design the world's smallest paranormal identifying device, coupling our tech with spiritual experts and paranormal enthusiasts. Our vision is to help the world seen and unseen. There was a lot of big this words. This feels like there. a scam to me. It probably is. It, like, are there product <laughs> reviews? Well, no. It's a, I think it's just a one-off, right? I just think if strange it things looks are like happening, you have to do strange things, like buy strange things. You know, we can just a... kind of YOLO it. But... Okay, I'm gonna YOLO it. I'm gonna YOLO it. Buy it now! Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Doper House. <laughs> <laughs> I'm also gonna grab some of the other devices too. You know, it's eBay and Etsy. It'll come over the next couple weeks. We'll check back in with you when all of these dope things arrive. Now, are we What? Bailey said the third package is here. This is the third time you've come in here with the camera, hoping uh -huh. that we got the package. <laughs> Call me an optimist. I'm excited. All right, you want me to look? Yeah. Where are the uh, packages that came? Does anyone know? <laughs> are the packages oh, duh, came? they're in the package cart. Yeah. <laughs> are there any with my name on it? This one. That definitely no. looks like an eBay box. Paranormal. Prowess. Oh. Is that the $450 one? This is the expensive one. Easy does it. Okay. It's tiny, tiny and yeah, little. Yeah, it was really small. It it's looks tiny. way smaller than it's in the picture. Oh, oh it's super that. small. Whoa. Okay, so I guess it wasn't a scam. No. I have a good feeling this well, is going to work because it we'll looks like in. someone who knows what they're doing put this together. <laughs> Yes, That's one. so tiny. I mean, there's wires poking out of it. It seems like it might be packed with a bunch of stuff. Yeah, you're right. I'm not going to touch those wires mm -hmm. when I plug it in. Yes. I would like to install the app. What? Oh, Actually? Whoa. It comes with an app? <laughs> oh, on. 20 seconds. What? See? Whoa. It's telling me to hold it. Wow. Whoa. Maybe not. Maybe I have to do it like this. Oh, I think it needs to be charged. I hold it. Oh, oh, <laughs> dang it. I pressed a button. It, it, it was doing something. Do you hear that? Yeah, it's it clicking. Was like a little click. Listen. That's weird. <gasps> oh, there it is. Whoa. It's a ghost. Okay. So it's giving me thermal readings right now. White hot. Yeah. Well, You're that's cool. Fire. Are there different modes? Yeah, there's different modes. There's a lot of different modes. <laughs> is this your camera or is it the camera that's attached it's, to that It's thing? Uh, this. Mm, interesting. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. So it's not the camera of the phone. Emissivity is a measure of how efficiently an object radiates heat. Choose what best resembles the material qualities of the object you are observing. Interesting. This one just looks like just normal camera. I don't see anything. You guys want to go to the location? Yeah, let's. I don't know, we always go up the long way. Okay. Turn off the light. I what? what? Do you see something? What? What? Wait, wait, wait. wait I can't. Wait, hold up, hold what up, hold up. F? What is what? it? No, you're kidding me. Can I expose different or? Oh, I just what? got shivers. What? I just what? got shivers. What? 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 Switch, switch camera. No way. What? 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 Wait, I was looking at the body. I didn't even see that. Those are footsteps. Can you straight up see? Hold on. I'm going to turn my phone brightness are... up. Can you see that? Yeah. <laughs> Dude. Okay, what? well. Those we are footsteps. We should follow them. So there are ghost footsteps? <laughs> He's wearing shoes. Can you, can you see that? 
head. That I don't understand how this happens. How, how does that work? Is it the temperature? How does a ghost leave footprints? No, that's not the thermal that's camera. That's not thermal. That's not thermal. That's that's, uh, that's a different plasma, setting. Right? Yeah, that's plasma. Shut up. No. What is this? <laughs> what is this? Are you screen recording this? You want me to screen record? Yes, please do. Okay, okay, hold on. Okay, screen recording. What is happening? I'm not sure. Oh, huh. that's it. Well, it's like it's like a crazy like. I mean, we have to follow it. I thought ghosts float. They walk. They, I guess maybe they can leave plasma. Look at some steps? of those. That's crazy. Yeah. I guess I'm so glad we got this thing off of eBay. Dude, yeah. what? What? Wait, where's it? Oh, where's it going? Wait, why? why? I just got shivers. Okay, I just well, got massive shivers. We have well, to follow let's go, it. Let's go follow it. So it doesn't go down the stairs. It's going down this way. Down here. Look. Oh, yeah, it, it doesn't oh go down God. the steps. That is too intense. I don't understand. Bro, it's like going into the theater room. No. You see that? Why? Wait, what? I saw a figure. I saw. No, you didn't. Yes, I, I don't swear. think I saw a figure. What did I you don't see? Know. I hope I didn't see a figure. What did you see? <laughs> Matt. What the heck is that? What is, is that, that? A, Is that? It went through the wall. It went through the wall. Is it there right now? I have no idea. Is is it there? Is it? That's did it terrifying. Go like yeah, plasma? that's the other side is. Wait, is is that where the find me was? Ah, I don't like it in here. What's on the other side of that? Is that the loft? That's no, no, no. That's what is what, this? where is the writers' room is going. Holy oh, cow! What? Oh what? No, I've been working in that room. <laughs> I've been working Why in that does room. It follow me. So I'm gonna go from where I think it might be. It should just be what, like the other side of this wall? Yeah. This wall. Yeah. Uh -huh. Like that. Oh. <gasps> what? Oh my god. Look at that. It goes down. Oh, it goes down. Why would it go? <laughs> why would it go? Yeah. Why would it go the wall to go down the stairs? Why wouldn't it have just gone down the stairs? Is it because they wrote something here? Is this from when it was writing the things, or but, is this but just that the order? Wouldn't have made sense. It would have gone here to there because yeah. this came oh, first. Oh yeah, that's a good point. But oh, why? Where's is that it going? not trippy though? That is that's so crazy. crazy. That's so trippy. Uh, I'm I'm kind of in disbelief that this product worked. Yeah, yeah. same. Thought I thought it was gonna be, gonna be a tail. Yeah. I thought it was gonna yeah. be like a joke. It just said a bunch of big words, and I was like, yeah, oh, okay, yeah, sure. Yeah. Clearly, it works. <laughs> Where do they go? You see it's, it's coming, coming down, down the stairs, the right? Uh, what is that? Just it's the, just going... The couch right? Yeah. Yeah, it's, okay. it's just going this what way. What the heck, dude? Why, dude? Why? Why on earth? When are we assuming this happened? Is Are we assuming this is... I mean, they, they, they left on? I would say maybe it was right after they spray painted the... The face. I would the assume. Face? So maybe it's going to show oh, us body? where the body is? I don't know. It's going gonna, it's gonna to send us to what we need to look closer at. Right. Okay. What's blowing my mind is I keep looking at the ground to like see something, but there's nothing. No, like, is there more over here? You see Whoa, that? wait. Yeah. What's like above it? It's like I mean, they're like stronger. The remnants? I don't know. <gasps> the closet? Wait, that's <laughs> that's isn't this under the room? Or is that or is that adjacent to it? Is it under? It's right under. Is it really? I don't know. Yes. Oh, and there's like a figure okay. in there? Easy does it, easy does it here. What open? Right, do we want to open you, this? Are you ready, Woods? Yeah, I'll be back here. What? Oh, I'm scared. Oh. What? <laughs> you know what? I, I just put the cabinet in there. What do you mean? The cab, the filing cabinet. I the put the cat. The well, filing cabinet that was in the, the storage, storage unit. unit that we never looked at? It's in there. It's in there. <laughs> well, okay, so. So that's what it's coming from? Wait, is it like that's leading us to evidence from? or something? So there must be more evidence in the one thing we didn't even look at. That was the one <laughs> thing we didn't look at in the look storage closer. unit. Look closer. <gasps> this is the <laughs> This is literally the piece that we've been missing. It's whatever is. Okay, can we bust out this lock? You have a hammer? 
Nope, nope. No, we, we need to break it open. How do we even break through this? We well, have a skill saw. Oh, yeah. I just got the shivers. So I just got the shivers. A, but, but that means there's something like ghost related in this. It, no, it might give because us, it has like plasma energy or whatever. It, it might is. be the answer to who killed them. Or, or who like, it is. is. Is this haunted? Is this a haunted violent Do we want to open, we do we wanna open this <laughs> and release whatever's in it? I, are you guys saying? Ah. Are you guys saying that the ghost lives in this cabinet? Yeah, I know. We brought the that's ghost that's home with the silence. Or, or the ghost, the ghost just wanted us to find this, so the ghost like walked to it. Okay, can I say or this something? Pandora's box. This is Wes's filing cabinet, right? Yes. Yeah. So <gasps> this is connected. This so, is so what if all this light stuff like is Wes, and this is Wes leading us back to this filing cabinet? Or just it's at least Project Eight Six Three related. Yeah, that, I mean, that, this does confirm that all of this is related to Project Eight Six Three. So welcome back, Matt. Oh no! <laughs> like this was in Wes's storage locker. Unless there's something else in here. Yeah, oh yeah, it must be these bounty paper towels. <laughs> there's Ew. a gaming computer. Maybe it's advertising a new paranormal video game. That'd no, a good spot it's, for a it's, it's this. We have a saw, yeah. A, a saw? <laughs> a skill saw. A skill saw? Yeah. Do you mean skill share? Check out the- Is it heavy? Ow. Do you want two okay? people? Yeah. yeah. You hold half of it. <laughs> As he just takes the whole thing by himself. <laughs> I just want to get it into the light. Thanks for the help, Sam. Oh, that was hard. We busted these locks before. I'm missing. <laughs> I think you're missing. That's really loud. <laughs> uh, he's... Oh. oh! Yeah, it totally, oh, that totally, it's totally worked. Bent. It, it just oh pushed through the lock. There are so many files in it. Super secure. <laughs> Wait, yeah, so this is what the ghost. What does it say on it? Just the files. Any familiar names? W, w Chase. Chase. Syntec profile summary. Wyatt Chase, 5'8, 145 weight, age 29. Physical description in red. These are like just employee files, official title, biochemist. So these are employees. These are employees. Pedro. These are employee files. Talia Jacobs, Chloe, redacted, official title. Additional That's information, weird. trial patient for Project Spire. Wait, Spire. Spire. Locate spire. the Spire. Yeah. Locate the Spire was like the last thing that we had heard from Deb. Chloe drew it. I've never heard that name no, before. I, this one is fully redacted. Deborah. Deborah. Blonde? She's blonde? This whole time I thought she was brunette. I can't see the last name. Read the information. We probably be blonde hair, green eyes. Deborah redacted, was hired. Head of clinical trials after her predecessor was involved in an unfortunate accident. Recommended by Nelson directly. She works with most subsections of the company, is essential in hiring for the laboratory. Since she was hired, the company has reached great strides in clinical trials and productivity, especially concerning quality of life for the animals. She studied at USC for her BS in biochemistry in Berkeley for her PhD, all with high marks from her peers. Deborah was described as bright, passionate, and fiery with a sharp eye and desire to make the world a better place. Who is writing these? She currently works mostly at location number three, but is known to rotate between location one, four, and nine, depending on trial schedules. She is one of the few people besides Wesley that work directly with. Who made these? Some Please. of her primary contributions to Syntec include Project Pegasus and Project Spire. They're saying Project Spire like it's an acronym. Yeah. What could that stand for? R -E. I don't know. What's the next one? The Wesley. next one is Wesley. Wesley. Wesley Nathaniel. Why would have Wesley have a file on himself unless this thing didn't belong to him? I know that's. Is this like Jordan Kendall? Like, was Jordan making like employee profiles? Oh. That's what this sounds. It sounds like it's written like. But Jordan in the syntax form. Yeah, Jordan but, Kendall was a um, reporter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, but she but you remember she was undercover. Yeah, like, and as Wesley an found her out. This could have been her research or something. Wesley Nathaniel, 5'11", 175, age 33. Blonde hair, Blonde blue hair, eyes. Visualize. Founded the company. Founder. Additional information started Syntec with partner co-founder Nelson Cyphus at extension available 015. 015. So 015 was his, his extension. extension. Oh, that makes so much sense. Wow. This is all just information. Gary's like who would the next is Gary Reynolds. Gary Reynolds. 511, 185. Brown hair, brown eyes. When when did it start? Please note that the first day was assigned to Syntec was 21085. Government uh, correspondent. Huh. He rarely speaks to anyone besides Nelson. This definitely looks like it's written not from like employee records. No, it feels like it's about all of them. Scott, Scott Cleric. Mr. Nathaniel's official assistant was transferred from location number 14. 
There's 14. 14? Wow. That's a lot. We found this name tag in Location where? 2 or Lo something? Where was that location 2? Like that like underground bunker. Jordan like, K. Uh, oh, what? Oh. oh, wait, so it's not. Could this be Siphus? Brown hair, brown eyes. When did they start official title? Biotechnician. She started late. Jordan was hired as a biotechnician. Include uh, scientists. Her in recruitment was short, quick, and she was recommended by Deborah specifically. She received her BS in Harvard and was looking towards expanding her resume. She's currently working with Deborah at location mm. number one. Okay, so Bailey, that's not. a great point. What if this is Siphus's? This is location number one. No, I know. I'm saying, what if well, this is Siphus's? No, well, like, not is yet. his name no. in here? Like Benjamin Cobalt is the next. Oh, Benjamin Cobalt. This is literally everyone. Oh, Benjamin was hired as head of chemical engineering. Black hair, blue eyes. Black hair, blue eyes. It's weird to think of him as a person. Mm -hmm. Benjamin was hired as head of chemical engineering after a long six month recruitment process, but ultimately came down to Ben's excellent demeanor. Excellent demeanor. Excellent. Hmm. Wow. This says he's 30. He started working at Syntec in 88. Wow. That's when I was born. Yeah. Daniela Reed, Autumn Hill, Carly Lewis, Maria Sanchez. Yeah, yeah these never... are all. Levi Foster. Holy cow. My word, there's so many. Bryce. Heather Williams. Oh, what are wait, we supposed there's, there's to? More. There's more. Are you serious? There's even more in the back. Oh my goodness oh my gracious. Gosh. Cole, Cole Damon. Damon and Isabella. Alejo, 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 Alejo. Yes. Okay, but so no Nelson Cyphers. No Nelson Cyphers. No. Well, wait, we still have the top one to go through. <sighs> okay, these look different. Just, yeah. Are these patients? Yeah, these patient medical profile. Jenny Watts. Patients. Yeah, or Jeannie Watts. What are we supposed to get out of this? Well, We're so, supposed to look at this. So, like, we just have a bunch of names we've never seen before. Matt. Is the ghost one of these patients? I mean, we've assumed that so many people Or one of the died. employees. Right. Yeah, so like this this ghost is either a patient <gasps> or an employee. Should I use this? On the files. Yes, because it might show like which one the ghost, ghost grabbed. Touched. Yeah. Do you think that this all started when we brought this thing mm -hmm. into our studio? Maybe. Yeah, I mean. There's been haunted objects before. Like I think a lot of objects mm -hmm. tend to, when a house is haunted or something, the spirit tends to be in the actual object. Mm -hmm. What am I looking at here? Here, I'm gonna record the screen. Oh, I can do it like this. Okay, so? Bro. Whoa! Whoa. Bro. Um, okay. Bro. One of them's cold. <sighs> That's not natural. Next time. Should I touch it? Yeah, pick right. it up. John Doe, email me back. Benjamin has no intention of talking with us. I was <laughs> like he's going to ask me. Okay, well, <laughs> we're here. If you missed last time, you can watch it right here. Here's what happened. And then writes it at 3 a.m., right? Yeah, what's it says, wrong? what's wrong? What do you no. mean, what's wrong? No, 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 no. If you want to deeper night. dive in this world, check out Project Date 63 Plus, where you get extra vlogs, podcasts, and a private Discord. Thanks for watching.